three main components to the mouse, a left button, a right button, and a wheel or trackball in the center. We will learn all about the mouse in this video. We place our index finger on the left side of the mouse and our middle finger on the right side of the mouse. Our thumb, ring finger, and pinky are used to hold the mouse tightly. To make it easier for you to click, make sure your index and middle fingers are slightly curved. We use our index finger to left click. Make sure to hold the mouse tightly while clicking. This will prevent you from accidentally clicking on the wrong thing. And this is also the button that we use most often. The arrow you see on your screen is called a cursor. When you move the mouse, the cursor moves with it. When you left click, you are telling the computer where you want its attention, kind of like your pointing finger. For example, if you wanted to open up a program, you would move your cursor to the program and left click to open it. Also, be aware of your arrow at all times because you don't want to accidentally click on something you didn't want to click on. We use our middle finger to right click. Again, make sure to hold the mouse tightly while clicking. This button is used to bring up a list of options. The options will vary depending on where you click. For example, I am clicking on the desktop. When I right click, I get a small list of options. Remember, only right click to bring up the list. After that, we continue to left click as usual. We also use our index finger to double click. Double clicking is when we click twice, somewhat fast. It is also used to open up files, folders, and programs. Right now I'm showing you how to double click on the desktop, but I actually want to show you how to double click to open up a folder. Uh, some people actually make the mistake of double clicking and moving at the same time and wonder why it didn't open. So just make sure that when you double click, you hold down the mouse so you don't move it. Notice the tiny ball or wheel in the center of your mouse? This is called a trackball or wheel, which is used to scroll through pages. Just glide your index finger over the ball to move it up and down. Here I am showing you how to scroll through a page on the internet. As you can see, the page is moving up and down, and I can do this by using the trackball on my mouse. Keep in mind, we are not clicking on the ball. We are simply gliding our finger to roll the ball. Okay, so that is it. Remember, the mouse is simply a pointing device. You move your mouse and the arrow will follow on the screen. If you do make a mistake, it's okay. Making mistakes is just part of the process. Just know that whatever it is, it can be fixed. You can watch this video as many times as you like. You can take notes while you watch the video as well, so you can refer to them while you're practicing. Take it day by day and you will get to a point where you will feel more comfortable with technology. Thanks for watching and good luck.